Hello all, welcome to my channel. Now in this video, I will show you how to extract the source code from Android application. So first of all, you need to use the different tools to decompile the application file. So I will use the ZX tool. So to download the ZX tool, you can just go to this particular path and that is sourcefork.net. So you can just copy this URL and you can paste over here in the browser and you will be able to see this screen that is ZX Dex to Java decompiler. You can just download this. It will be start within five seconds. You can check the progress over here. It is being downloaded. Now you can see over here that only 30 seconds are left. Now once this file is downloaded, you can just go to so in the folder and see here ZX GUI no JRE Windows file is available. You don't need to install this particular tool explicitly. This is no JRE version. So you can directly open this file without installation and you can open any APK file. Now we need any application file. So I will just download the APK file of Facebook. So see here in the step number two, I want to download the Facebook Lite APK file. So I'm just going to this particular URL. You can just paste this URL over here and you will be able to see here download option. You can download the Facebook Lite APK. It is about 2.34 MB and it is being downloaded. You can just go to the so in folder. So now here I have two files. One is APK. Another one is ZX GUI no JRE Windows. Now you can just double click on this ZX tool. So ZX is open. Now you can just click on open over here and you can just select your APK file from the path. So where this file is available, it is available in my download folder. So here in my download folder, I need the file that is Facebook Lite. So you can copy this wall path and you can paste over here and you can click on open. So here you will be able to see that this is the resource which are available over here. All the assets file available. You can just look at the manifest file. This is the manifest file of Facebook. Facebook using the permissions like camera, telephony, microphone, location, GPS, Wi-Fi, touchscreen, access communication, battery status, broadcast sticky, camera, cell phone, this all permission are available over here that you can see that these are the permissions which is used by Facebook. Here you can just see that different types of activities and receivers information. Even you will be able to access the provider information over here. These are the provider which are used by the Facebook. Even you will be able to see that these are the receiver and even you will be able to see the service information of Facebook application. Not only this, you can just look at over here. You can get the information about the activities also. These are the activities which is used by the Facebook. If you want to access the separate information of each activity, then you can just go over here. That is com.facebook and here there are so many packages are available. Here you will be able to see the different different class. So this is the class for client application splitted cell which is extended from application. Suppose if you want to access the light class preloader delegate over here, so you can just click over here. So you will be able to see that this is the class which is a light class preloader delegate. So you can get the information about the different kinds of classes which are used over here by the Facebook application and you can extract the source information. So this is the way you can extract source code from any applications. Right now I have extracted the source code information from Facebook application. You can also extract the source code information from the different applications like WhatsApp or any other application that whatever you want. So that's it from my side. If you like this video, then you can like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.